So today I'm going to read for you the Greek alphabet. To elinico alfavito. I'm going to show you the capital letter, the small letter. I'm going to read its name and finally the sound. So this is alpha. Alpha. And it sounds like a. Ah. This is vita. Vita. And it sounds like v. This is gamma. Gamma. And it sounds like g. This is delta. Delta. And it sounds like v. This is epsilon. Epsilon. And it sounds like e. This is zeta. Zeta. And it sounds like z. This is eta. Eta. And it sounds like e. This is theta. Theta. And it sounds like th. This is iota. Iota. And it sounds like e. This is kappa. Kappa. And it sounds like k. This is lambda, lambda, and it sounds like l. This is me, me, and it sounds like m. Mm. This is ni, ni, and it sounds like n. Mm. This is xi, xi, and it sounds like x. This is omicron. Omicron, and it sounds like O. This is P, P, and it sounds like P. This is Rho, Rho, and it sounds like R. This is Sigma, Sigma, and it sounds like S. This is Taf, Taf, and it sounds like T. This is epsilon, epsilon, and it sounds like e. This is phi, phi, and it sounds like f. This is he, he, and it sounds like h. This is psi, psi, and it sounds like ps. This is o. Omega, Omega, and it sounds like O. So, you might have noticed we have two letters that sound like O in Greek, Omega and Omicron. And we have three E's. One is Y, one is Yota, and one is Ita. Also, in this letter, we have the small sigma that you can find in the beginning or in the middle of a word. And this you will only see in the end. Now, let me read for you the words that start uh, with its letter in alphabetical order. Anna. Varka, Gata, Zoro, Ego, Zoe, Ilios, Falasa, Istos. You see that in the end is different. Kalos, Lagos, Mama. Nero, Xilo, Olos, Pagos, Roloi, Sico, Tora, Hipnos, Fotia, Hina, Psari, Ora. You may have also noticed a small dot 
This is a stressing mark. You will always see stressing marks on words if they have two syllables or more. And this is where you will be stressing the word. This is why I said pagos and not pagos. So it seems like we have missed out some sounds, but in Greek there are some double letters that covers that. Vowels and consonants. So let's have a look at the vowels first. Alpha, iota, that's the name of the double vowel, sounds like e. Omicron, iota, sounds like e. Ypsilon, iota, sounds like e. Although this combination is not very common anymore. Epsilon, iota, sounds like e. Omicron Y sounds like U. Alpha Y sounds like AF or AV. Epsilon Y sounds like F or EV. So now let's read the words. Emma. Ikoyenia. Ios. Ime. Uranos, afti, avgo, efkolo, eva. Now let's see the double consonants. Mi, pi, this is the name of the double consonant, and it sounds like b. Ni, taf, sounds like d. Gamma, Kappa sounds like G. Gamma, gamma sounds like G as well. Taf, sigma sounds like Ts. Taf, zeta sounds like J. So now let's read the words. Babas, dino, agira. Egoni, tsepi, zaki. And now you can read anything in Greek.